Let us now discuss a small concept of conservative forces. Conservative forces, the example is, you can say, gravitational force are those forces in which the work done in moving a particle from one position A to another position B is independent of path. So, if I am having a ball over here and suppose my ground level is over here, if I am uh, if I am uh, moving ball over here from the position A to position B through this path or through this path or directly in a straight line, the work done in the in moving the body against the gravitational force mg that is weight of the ball would be same in all the three cases. So you can say that in conservative forces, conservative forces, the work done depends only on final and initial and initial position of the body so it ultimately depends on energy in final position and energy in initial position and work done delta w can be regarded as change in potential energy that is delta u that is uh, a potential energy in final position minus potential energy in initial position suppose i am suppose i am having a, a mass m at this side mass m and height of h then uh, i can say that if if the mass will fall through this path or through this path or straight way downwards then the work done that is change in its energy would be equals to mgh itself because at the initial position its uh, total potential energy with respect to ground ground surface is uh, mgh and uh, when it will reach the ground when it will reach the ground surface its all potential energy will be converted into kinetic energy where its velocity would be equals to root 2 gh so that total kinetic energy at the end would be equals to half mv square that you can say half m into root 2 gh square so that is equals to 2 into g into h so that is ultimately equals to mgh so potential energy at this point that is equals to kinetic energy is at this point so now this does not depend whether the body falls through this trajectory or through this trajectory what ultimately matters is the change in height of the body that decides the change in potential energy of the body